Okay. Here's a new website I just launched. With the help of someone named Chris Blaze. It's a way to spin the Wii globe in your browser. And you can zoom in and out of it. You can spin it, it'll make sounds. Um, I can use the arrow keys. It's not perfect, but it's it gets the job done. And um, you can see kind of lines here, but don't worry about them. This is pretty much it, because everyone loves spinning the globe on their Wii. And now you can use it on your browser. This was originally part of the Reconnect 24 website in 2023 when I was desperately trying to find something to make us stand out from Wii Link, on, at least on our site. So I added this to the main homepage, but it got removed when they redesigned it after the merge happened. I have a cold, by the way, so if my voice sounds a little bit different, that's why. I'm finally starting to feel better, though. Oh. I don't... Oh, yeah, one more thing. It either switches between the Forecast Globe Day theme, the Forecast Glo Globe Night theme, or the um, News Channel theme. And the way it works is that it, um, I think that the Night Day theme plays from 5 a.m. to 6 p.m. on the Forecast Channel. So if with the JavaScript we added, if it detects that you're in those time frames, it'll play the Day theme. There's a 50% chance it'll play the Day theme, but if um, or the News Channel theme, and if it's night, it'll play the news channel, I mean, the forecast channel theme with a 50% chance every time you refresh it. I had to go in here and disable the allow audio and video. Um, also, on that note, let me, I want to bring one more thing to your attention. So, if you go in the Wheeling news channel right now, I'm not going to update. Uh, okay, it's not loading. But anyway, here's what I noticed with the news channel. It's broken in every single language except Italian and Dutch. Because um, Associated Press changed their API, the one that they were using for the news channel, and that I coded on my script stopped working. So it's something that someone like Sketch needs to work on and fix because it's, it's, this, it's annoying because I don't know when they're going to fix it, because I don't know anything about what Wii Link's doing, but hopefully they'll emerge from it, because they completely changed the API. It's not using a JSON-powered API, if you know what that is. It's using, like, a GraphQL endpoint, and I hope they use the news, the associated press for the news channel, not something like Apple News, but we'll see how it goes. Until then, the news channel is completely broken, and they're their team will have to hear screeches and cries from so many people that it's displaying no news. Like, it will launch, but there's nothing to browse there because there's no articles. Unless you're in, if your Wii language is European and said to Italian or Dutch. It's annoying, but I heard that they were working on a rewrite of the news channel for, and it's been ready for like over a year. And it's also snowing outside, by the way, in Texas here. And the forecast channel works fine in all the other channels. It's just that one that needs to be fixed. There will be the link for this thing in the description if you want to play around with it. And I also included, if you see here, I also included the star background from the actual channel. I mean, it doesn't move around, but yeah. You could take this a notch further and add stuff like the like cities on the globe to view the weather or something like that, but I'm not doing that. I have no plans to. But it would be cool. But we can dream. It's beautiful. The the globe the the image for the globe is taken from a um, NASA blue marble. Um hold on. So there was something, um There was a there was a page somewhere that had the actual image. Yep, this one. I'm using this on my M4 Mac Mini, by the way. I'm showing you this. Um, yeah, it's going to probably break my computer if I download this. <laughs> but 
But it's the whole image. Basically, what Nintendo did is color correct it. Made it more bright and poppy. This image is from 2002. It's a TIFF image, so it'll take a minute to download. Yeah, it's... It's... It's max resolution is a whopping 43,200 and by 21,600 pixels. Here's a very small image of it. But basically they somehow map that to a globe and then use that on the channel. Yeah. They use it on the channel. I just want to show the image loading real quick. Oh, it failed. Oh, well. <laughs> it's a slow server. Oh, my goodness. How about this one? Here it is. Here's a big image. If it will download, it will be very cool to see. <laughs> yeah, it's failing for some reason, but anyway, that's my video for you. Bye.